days. It's very difficult to find a sports car that doesn't try and cram fancy gizmos and gadgets down your throat in the name of making you a better driver. If there's one car that proves that you don't need sport modes and adjustable steering, it's this. The 2018 Nissan 370Z Nismo. The 370Z first came out in 2009, so well, it's not new. It's essentially a nine-year-old car, and in some areas, you can see that, especially inside. So for about $50,000, you get a body kit that looks very nice, actually. You also get a number of suspension and chassis enhancements under the skin, like stiffer springs, stiffer dampers, thicker anti-roll bars. You also get a limited slip differential. You get wider tires and you get an exhaust that sounds absolutely amazing. You also get a bit more power. The standard 370Z puts out 332 horsepower and the Nismo is good for 350. But of course, none of that matters because you get red stripes on the bumpers and you get red brake calipers. Perfect. On the road, Partly because of all the suspension upgrades the Nismo package adds, the ride does come across as a bit harsh. Plus, when you're on the highway, the road noise is pretty loud, and for that you have the 19-inch wheels to thank. So, over the standard 370Z, the Nismo package adds a very nice part Alcantara, part leather steering wheel with a little leather stripe up here because it's a race car. You also get a pair of absolutely fantastic Recaro seats. Visibility is a bit compromised, especially out of the rear view mirror. It's kind of useless back there. The other area the 370 Nismo shows its age is the infotainment system. It's not difficult to use per se, it's just that it's a pretty pixelated system and it takes a few prods at the touchscreen to register your inputs. Thankfully, you also have real buttons on the center stack as well. All in all, the 370Z is a time capsule of a car. It might have been around for a few years, and it actually might not be around with us for much longer, but that doesn't mean you should dismiss the 370Z altogether, because when it's gone, you'll probably miss it as much as I would. For Driving.ca, I'm Nick Tragianis.